For today's comparison, we have the Motorola X30 Pro versus the Motorola S30 Pro. Now let's begin. So the screen type for a very long while, I haven't seen any P OLED screen. So it's good. Ooh, the S30 is slightly better. So basically both are using the same screen. You either go with a bigger screen or a slightly better megapixel. Basically they are the same screen. Now for the performance. best chipset in the world, Snapdragon 8 Plus. And the X30 is coming with a bigger charger, but basically they will be charging at the same time. But the performance of the X30 has way better and believable over the camera. Well, the X30 main camera is at whopping 200 megapixel, that's big. Ultra wide lens 50 megapixel and the telephoto lens is just 12 megapixel. Will that be compared to the Samsung S22 Ultra? Let's see. The X30 is also capable of 8K video recording. The S30 is just like a standard device. 60 megapixel selfie camera. Yeah, oh, that X30. Something else. So basically, as you can see, the X30 clearly has a better camera. The S30 is okay now, don't get me wrong, it's okay. I'm wondering if the X30 is better than the iPhone. Could be, could be. But they're both using the same storage. For the X30, I definitely recommend the 512 gig storage. Are you gonna need a lot of storage to use with the camera? Now for design. As you know, the S30, there's the two variants. The blue one is 167 grams, so it's lighter than the black version. Well, as you can see, both devices have a similar design, but the X30, I would say it's better. Not for the result, but both devices have a similar design, as I said earlier. The pricing, you're paying for the chipset of the X30, unlike the S30 is a lot cheaper, but the winner definitely go to the X30, it has a better screen. Better design, way better camera, both devices the same storage, and it does a better design and features. Comment below which video you want me to do next. See you in the next video guys.